Hello everybody, I'm Katerina Cherkova and I'm a facilitator of free baby program in the Association of Ukrainian Guides. Uh, the fact that Ukraine uh, has some of the finest women in the world is not something that can be argued. This is a border talk and that's what I've heard for most of my life, my former life. Because now the life has changed. Uh, in Ukraine it is a war, but life has not stopped. So Ukrainian women and young girls still want to be happy, uh, still want to make friends, still want to make families, to study and live their normal life. Uh, the war claimed many lives, but unfortunately not many stereotypes and customs, especially about their appearance. So being, being uh, beautiful means very much in Ukraine. Uh, and now freezing in the houses without heating, without hot water, without electricity and not having the opportunity to wash our hair as often as we used to, uh, wearing some second, second hand clothing uh, that not fit us or losing weight from stress or gaining weight from stress eating. In the worst cases, losing a limb during the war is not something that at our body of confidence at all. So many, many uh, teenagers and especially girls feel anxious and depressed about their appearance right now. Um, even those who moved from Ukraine um, are very vulnerable in this case, um, finding themselves in new uh, environment in new schools in the new language and culture um, obviously decreased their self-esteem uh, we decided that it is now right time in ukraine to start for being a program uh, we were thankful for giving us opportunity to have the training for trainers and now we are starting to adapt and translate the program for the girls. Uh, we hope to involve um, teachers and students from Odessa, Kiev, Kharkov, Lviv, Chernivtsi, Chernigov and all of the um, big cities, at least all the big cities in Ukraine. We are sure that Fribimi program will have a success in Ukraine and uh, we would love to um, make it happen in Ukraine um, even during the wartime. So thank you very much.